Hey guys, Mike from Getting Greasy Garage. Uh, I got something a little different for you today. Uh, feeling a little bit under the weather, but I still made it out into the shop and doing a few little projects. Um, so I'll show you what it looks like. Obviously, it's got a cord. Okay. There's the name, Electrolux. Now, there's a uh, couple of guys out there that I know that might know what this is. Uh, Matt the Scrap, Whip, Scrap Whisperer, he probably knows, and uh, I'll bet Ed at, uh, at Gosselin Gosselin Farms, he might know what this is. I'll bet you guys uh, have seen these before, for those of you that don't know. So, I think in the 50s, I'm not sure couldn't find the info I was looking for. Uh, there was a, a vacuum cleaner company, Electrolux. And they had a vacuum cleaner that on the end of it had this retractable hose reel. And the way that it worked is... You have this little knob down here. So this thing mounted, oh, okay, it's already done. Mounted like this up on the end of the vacuum cleaner. Okay, so you flip it up like so. That was the air outlet for the air coming in the vacuum cleaner through the bag. And this was where the air blew out of the vacuum cleaner. So when it's in the up position, you can grab the hose reel, or the, uh, not hose reel, the cord, run the cord out, and it will latch. And when you were done, you simply closed it, and then tighten the little latch, which keeps it locked, and it would reel itself in. And I, I didn't measure this, but there's probably 20, 25 feet on here. Um, we had one of these old vacuums laying around when I was cleaning up a bunch of junk. I went ahead and salvaged this off of the end of that vacuum cleaner. So this end, the fixed end of the wire, was, uh, you know, hooked to the vacuum cleaner itself. And then this, you had the your standard male plug. And I took it off, put a female on it. And I took an old uh, monitor cord computer monitor cord, wired that on, and I intend to use this up on my workbench because I'm in a small shop, I don't have a lot of space, and not having to wind up a uh, cord is really nice, so uh, anyway, right now I'll put up what the vacuum cleaner looked like, so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Okay, so anyway, those are uh, some pictures I found online, just to give you an idea. Uh, that one is a little bit different model, but you know, I'm thinking, you know, mid-late 50s, maybe early 60s on this, and it was just kind of a neat deal, and then being a, a retractable cord, um, you know, I, I can use this for all the four and a half inch grinders, stuff like, smaller stuff like that, the uh, electric drill it's not stuff that's going to see a huge load because you know it's not a huge cord so um anyway just kind of repurposing some old junk and thought you guys might like that it's an easy project to do today just to solder the wires on this cord together and change this out and i kind of cleaned it up a little bit and oiled everything and so Anyway, not much of a video today, guys. Just, like I say, feeling under the weather. But I get bored laying on the couch, so I still manage to make it out here to the shop. But uh, anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. 
If you would please like, share, comment, all the above. All that stuff's free, doesn't cost you a thing, and helps out the channel. So, anyway, stay greasy, my friends.